Ani habari za Jumapili hope wengi mlikwenda kwenye shughuli za ibada. Mkutano huu ni muhimu sana kwetu kwa sababu kwanza unakuja na lile jambo ambalo mmeliandika andika, mmelisema sema, mmegeza mme sana huko, mmebashiri. Uh, lakini kama tulivyotengeneza utaratibu wetu wengi wenu labda mlishindwa ku kupata hilo ambalo mlikuwa mnalifikiria kikubwa ni kwamba leo tumekuja na lile jambo letu kuingia kwenye Champions League kwenye tournament ya Super Cup tuliwaahidi juzi tutaanza na head coach wetu na staff wengine wa technical bench na tunatekeleza kwa hiyo ni mwache CEO Baba Gonzalez aweze kumtambulisha aliye mbele yenu ni nani anaitwa nani ametoka nchi gani na yuko hapa kwa ajili ya kitu gani Barbara karibu sana CEO wa Club Simba Asante bwana Hadi za mchana jamani wote wote ya mjambo Asalamu alaikum Tulivyokubaliana kwenye press ya Ijumaa leo nimemwalika kocha wetu mpya na mtambulisha Didier Gomez de Rosa Shuli yetu ya leo ni kumtambulisha rasmi anajiunga kuanzia leo na leo anaenda mazoezini Coach Didier ni raia wa France Mfaransa ametoka Sudan alikuwa anafanya kazi klabu moja inaitwa Almirek na amejiunga na si kuanzia leo rasmi leo tutaanza shuli ya kumsainisha rasmi na klabu yetu na ningependa yeye yeah, endelee kutoa ufafanuzi kuhusu background yake na nini but kabla ya kumtambulisha lazima nitoe ufafanuzi ya mchakato ya kuchagua kocha tulivyo sema nilivyokuwa Zanzibar tulipata CV sabini. tumekaa kwenye interviews tumepata references za baadhi ya wachezaji walikuwa wanafanya kazi nao makocha tumepata references ya baadhi ya makocha na technical bench walikuwa wanafanya kazi na our shortlisted candidates paka imefika mwisho tumekaa na mwenyekiti wa bodi na baadhi ya wajumbe wa bodi na watu wa technical kuchambua shortlisted candidates kwenye CV mpaka tulipofika na kocha mkuu wetu Didier. So mimi ningependa kabla ya kuendelea ajitambulishe then wote unakaribishwa kuuliza maswali. So welcome coach Didier. I was giving just a little bit of a background as to how we got here. Um, we've been engaging for a little bit over a week. Um, we've gone through this process of picking several candidates and I didn't want to give too much of your story. I thought I wanted to give you the comfort and the space to explain your own story. Why you're here, who you are and why Simba and why Tanzania. So welcome coach Didier. The Sunday floor is yours. The, yeah. What about in the future miaka minne tatu hivi karibuni lazima uwe na kocha wa Tanzania ana UEFA Pro amekaa hapa tumemsanisha rasmi kwa kwa leo naomba tu focus kwenye press ya leo press ya leo ni kumtambulisha rasmi kocha wetu mkuu anaitwa Didier na ningependa maswali yote yende moja kwa moja kwa si kama una, kuna maswali mengine na Naomba ni niseme hivi Simba ilikuwa imefanya mazungumzo na kocha huyu katika kipindi hiki ambacho baada ya kuondoka kocha wetu Simba ilimua, il, ilikuwa haina kocha wa makipa kwa muda mrefu. Kwa hiyo tunaendelea na mazungumzo na ule kocha, wakati tunaendelea mazungumzo na kocha yule wa makipa ndio kocha Sven akaondoka. 
Kwa hiyo hakukuwa na namna ya kwamba kocha huyu awe ni sehemu ya kumtafuta kocha wa makipa. Na nirejee tena nilisema Barbara tujikite kuna vitu vingi sana ambavyo na nyinyi wana habari ningefaidika navyo kama vile kuuliza falsafa ya mwalimu contract eh, yake tujikite kwenye maswali ambayo yatakuja ku, kuleta maana kwa maana ya presi Gode ni tafuta mwingine kuna mwingine maji wake hivi <laughs> sio kwa faida yenu uh, coach amezungumzia swala la kwamba kikubwa amezungumzia kwamba tuna matumaini makubwa uh, na naamini timu yetu ina ubora anaamini kwamba tunacheza vizuri amewaangalia katika mechi kwa mfano anasema na Platinum ilikuwa ni kama mashine hivi namna ilivyokuwa inacheza ule uwezo wa timu ya Simba kaliba wachezaji wetu na anaamini katika kipindi kifupi kijacho tutahitaji kushinda hizo mechi tatu ambazo ziko ni viporo vyetu ili tukae juu ya tebo lakini pia anajua tu katika kundi gumu mpira umebadilika timu zimebadilika marekh vita of course na ahli ambao ndio champions wa last season lakini anaamini tutafanya vizuri kwa sababu tuna wachezaji wazuri tuna kikosi bora na anasema ya zitakuwepo mabadiliko fulani fulani ambayo tuyatarajie kocha yote mpya anapokuja you know the when you are coach in a very high level very ambition ambitious club uh, it's difficult to to stay for example, if I talk about his smiley, uh, I push his, his smiley in the Arab Cup semi-final. It's a big, big competition. You, you understand? I push them uh, in the semi-final. Even we won the, the first leg of the semi-final against Raga at home, 1-0. And also after two draw in a league, when you make a draw in a league, it, it's very bad eh, for this kind of... Uh, of club, so you you are not secure, you know. For the Helmerek, uh, it is uh, my own decision. Uh, really, I talk uh, with them since a long time after the or qualification, and it is my own decision. But you know, I spend um, two years in Cameroon, uh, I spend uh, two years in Algeria, and also now we we need to talk about Simba. Really, I want to stay with Simba uh, uh, a lot of time. I'm not a traveler, you understand? Coach, I'm a little bit so for to forty. Like I'm a sema, he's on the the changa moto the ma coach na nikitu chakawaida na katungini pressure clubs kubwa kumfano na sema alvo kwa Ismaili alufika mbaka semi final ya Arab nini? Cup. Arab Cup. Like ni ilitokea kitu tofauti kwa ikabidi lazima aondoke lakini pia amekaa mfano Cotton Sport ya Cameroon amesema amekaa 2 years Algeria amekaa 2 years na na matarajio na klabu ya Simba atatumia muda wake mwingi na atakaa kwa muda mrefu katika klabu hii insha Allah hiyo ni muongezea mimi insha Allah insha Allah haya ndio vizuri introduction ya, ya CEO kuhusu mchakato huu ungelisikia lile na ungeona Yaani mazingira ya Simba yaliyokuwa tusiwe tunajaribu kuleta kitu ambacho hakiwezekaniki. Yaani tuwe wa kweli. Tuwe 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 realistic kidogo. Hatuwezi kusema kocha alihusika na usajili wa Chikwende. Wakati bado tulikuwa na kocha mwingine anaitwa Sven. Kwa hiyo mimi sitaki ni, ni, ni kwambie kitu ambacho cha uongo. Focus na coach mpya na maandalizi ya Champions League. Period. Yeah, 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 of course, I follow your, your link since uh, many years, you know. Uh, I follow particularly Simba. Huh? Uh, I, uh, I'm very interested by all uh, African uh, league. It is important for a professional coach to, to know all the league, and uh, particularly I know very well your, your, your team. Uh, for example, Mehdi Kagere was, uh, was my player with uh, Coton Sport, but I can watch a lot of match uh, uh, from uh, from Simba, uh, and I already identify some very good characteristic. And the uh, U League is uh, growing up step by step every, each year by each year, so it is a very good uh, level uh, league. Coach, 
taratibu kidogo kidogo inazidi kukua sasa hivi na ana anafahamu mengi kuhusu yetu na anamjua hata Medi Kagere ambaye alimfundisha Rayo 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 Sports pal Rwanda kwa hiyo anafahamu mengi kuhusu Simba kuhusu yetu kwa hiyo sio mgeni na yeye ni mpenzi wa kufuatilia ligi za Afrika kwa sababu kama professional coach ana wajibu anifundisha Afrika ana wajibu wa kuangalia ligi zetu za Afrika you know um, discipline is the most important if you want to reach the high level you need to be very very disciplined you cannot win a lot of titles uh, without discipline so i love my player every time but i'm very demanding with them you know and when you are coach you are experiment coach you know how can you you can or you can act with the player it's very important but also uh, yeah i'm uh, i'm right with you eh? uh, discipline is one of the the key to reach the high level uh, success na ili ushinde trophies lazima nidhamu ijengwe anawapenda wachezaji wapenda wachezaji kama alivyokuwa anawapenda siku zote lakini bado msingi wa nidhamu utakuwa uko pale pale sio didie didi eh nimekuambia ah ah inatamkwa didi my mozo wa komiti ah eh unasikia anasema mama yake anatamka jina didi na anapenda nini mtamke didi okay haya jina kama ni kuandikwa inaitwa didi sasa ile so didiel kama ile ya didiel alikuwa kabumbabu alikuwa klabu ya yanga pamoja na azam si kocha ambaye anatokea kesale ya sudani I can tell Okay. Sasa tunakwenda kwenye tukio lingine.